Okay, before the battle starts, there's a few things I'd like to say. Uh, there will be some new teams coming up. Uh, we're going to have a hat, and then we're going to put some Pokemon names in it, and then we're going to draw Pokemon out of the hat, and that will dictate the Pokemon on a new team or two, and we got to find a way to make those Pokemon work together, as it will be double battles, and it's a bit silly putting a singles team in doubles. Okay, and they start with the Dragon Rage, and uh, <laughs> it's silly really. And Earthquake, that's obvious. All Swampets have Earthquake, and uh, and now Ring Camp goes to Head Smash, and hmm, if it wasn't with that Rock Kid, it'd probably have a concussion by now. Uh, but that's the beauty of it, it has Rock Head, and it gets the same type of attack bonus, which is brilliant. I'm surprised I don't see that that often, but you can do the same thing with Agron, and I'll get Trick Room up, and they send out Togekiss. And Togekiss is known to be fairly bulky, but Head Smash again. And that's all Relicanth really does, because its head is really the only useful part of its body, because its fins can't really do much, and it's probably quite a slow swimmer, but it, you can give it swift swim. But I prefer to have it with Rockhead, obviously. I really think I should have gone to Swampert at this moment with Head Smash because it was there from start to end and I never really managed to sink it. With I nearly did, but I'll save that to the end. No spoilers. And out comes Espeon. And I think it's strange why they don't have a light type in in Pokemon. It, some people say the psychic type counts for light, but light psychic type is more for telepathic powers and telekinesis and whatnot. And now Jugong fakes out and people don't really expect that from Jugong. Fake is actually a surprisingly good dark cry counter. Guy can fake out and then make sure Trip can get set up and then just take out Dark Cry on the next turn. But some people do give their Dark Cry's protect. Someone had an exploding metaphors with a protecting Dark Cry. But then they got annoyed when I set up Safeguard and then just quit. And that was before I had the YouTube channel. Otherwise that video would obviously be posted because it was so epic. And Signal Beam, and not many people expect that either, but a lot of Ice types can learn Signal Beam, I think. I only go for Psychic, and I don't know if you noticed, but most OU teams are very same type attack bonus orientated. Uh, which I suppose makes sense, because why would you be doing that when you can do this and be a lot cheaper? Yep, like with the return Snorlax and etc. etc. Uh, <coughs> now, Hammer Arm, I didn't think it would faint it, because my Dugong is very bulky. It managed to survive a facade from a burned Ursarang. Uh, but that's another story. There they go for a psychic. And that must mean they're either idiots or they were ganging up on Jugo. Probably the idiots one. Uh, and. Uh, it's Crickle Tune. And then they go psychic again, which faints Slowbro. I don't know what it's looking behind for, because there's nothing there. Aha! And now Espeon faints to the tune of my exes or shame uh, Crickledoon doesn't have a little dance to go with its uh, musical abilities because that would be quite cool. Now we go for another waterfall but this bug is one that doesn't get squished that easily and it does a lot more stinging than buzzing if you haven't noticed. I've made it quite effective. <laughs> See him protect and this last protect is the whole reason why I lost because of the leftovers and I suppose protect stalling at the end is useless unless you have an item like leftovers or uh, black sludge or the other one I think it's shell salt or something or other it's shell something and this one put survives with 1 HP OMG WFT you know this stuff and and now they finally eradicate my Crickle Tune. And another thing, I think Crusade never does steal like Pokemon. 
just enough to keep making new teams. But Wi-Fi is a bit off-putting for him. And remember, we will be drawing some Pokemon names.